shit, we actually did it. What the hell? <laughs> 3,000 subscribers. Wow, oh, holy god. Hey, welcome, gamer girls. Welcome to this very special video. Yes, you're absolutely right. We just crossed 3,000 subscribers. Holy god, it feels so surreal. It's actually insane. Like, thank you guys so much that... I live to see the day where I actually acquire 3,000 subscribers. That's an insane number. Like, I haven't even seen 3,000 people it, at, at the same time close together. And if you think about how many people that actually is, it's insane. So thank you guys very much. But today, we are gonna do a Q&A. Because I announced one a video ago. So... <coughs> Let's look at the questions that you guys actually ask, because there were some seriously spicy questions in, in those, at those. What Nika Shai asks, how do we eliminate old thoughts? By taking back the holy land. Fireheart, the GLM invading... GL... make... A great name, by the way. I can't even... I butchered that. Thank you. He has a few questions. Question 1. If you didn't do YouTube, what would you be doing now? Probably focus my ass off on school and actually f actually complete the goddamn semester. But since I'm doing YouTube... Yeah, <laughs> we're here. <laughs> Question 2. What was your favorite thing funny thing that happened this year? Well, since this year has actually gone down the drain so much um, meeting people on VR chat I've recently started playing VR chat together with my editor and some other friends and I've met a lot of people on there which is actually insane and throughout this whole 2020 actually I've met so many new people from discord groups from other friends meeting other friends playing PUBG with different people it's insane the amount of people I've met this year is actually probably more than I've met throughout my entire life, which sounds very sad, and it is. Next question comes from IJ Slap, aka my editor. When do I get paid? Never. <laughs> get back to your basement and start editing for me again, holy goddamn. The Mad Meme Lad. How can I get my meme cringe videos more views and attract a bigger audience? Just go to Reddit, copy paste every single meme you see there, add some slapstick sound effects to them, and you've got your audience. Lord Kale asks, does the anime girl outfit still fit? No, mate. No, 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 no. You're not gonna, you're not gonna do this. No, I refuse. <laughs> This was a mistake! Call me V asks, what's your motivation? Motivations for life? I don't have any. Motivations for YouTube? Making people laugh, mostly. If I can. If 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 there is a chance that I make you laugh by watching these videos, then my goal is complete. I will ascend to the heaven. <laughs> she also asks, do you play PvP games? If not, why? Um PvP games as in Minecraft Hunger Games because I am an actual god at that 1v1 me IRL no, <laughs> no I play I play competitive multiplayer games I've played Overwatch for quite some time play PUBG and, and CSGO I've played that once in my life that's probably it I, mo I mostly play single player games myself because I'm a fucking pussy and I'm bad at video games <laughs> buzzing ah very funny Dude, sir, you did the funny. You did the big time thing funny. Laugh. Asks, what is your sexual preference? You are. Jennifer Manny asks, who is slash are your favorite YouTubers? At the moment, I think the number one inspiration slash my favorite YouTuber is probably Jennifer Manny. Though I think his content has been going down slightly since he started doing mostly Reddit reviews and stuff like that. He's still one of my biggest inspirations and the, probably the person that I single-handedly watch the most hours on the internet. Um, and I just... He, he's been a part of my daily life for almost uh, half of my life, basically. I've, I've started watching him since 2012, and that's 8 years ago, and I'm almost 20. 
So holy god. So PewDiePie, but there are so many more others where I take inspiration from editing. Uh, Spectacu is a smaller channel that makes very good gameplay videos edited wise, um, which got me back into editing mostly. Toomad is also a very great editor. Uh, Andrew JRT, I'm also very good at editing. And of course, I J Slap. Uh, my content is basically the editing. Me as a person have a shit personality. Not funny at all. Edits. <laughs> Stinky. <laughs> that uh, that uh, that makes it. That makes this watchable. <laughs> Call me King Crimson. Ass. Can you make a cooking video that has Dota by Base Hunter as the background? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Welcome. Mooning Mans has a serious amount of questions, so let's just take a look at them. Number one, what happened to the person you started the channel with? Don't answer this if there's a video on it, lol. There is actually no video on it, but let me just keep it short. Um, we just stopped having contact with each other. The guy I started this channel with, the Fluffy Puncher, um, it was a good friend of mine, we started making Minecraft videos together, Minecraft Let's Plays and stuff like that with a story connected to it. But um, over the years we grew a bit apart and after we passed a thousand subscribers I think, he actually, we had an indifference about the channel and, and that made him just leave the channel. And we had, we had, we still had have some contact over the years, but I haven't recently talked to him in like two years or something. But I, I don't think there's any bad blood between us. If you guys think that, no, we just stopped like having contact with each other. Hope he's still cool with me. I don't know. <laughs> if you're watching this, hey, what's up? Um, you can always come back and make a video together if you want. Number two, what or who made you want to start the channel? Well, this channel particularly was started because I wanted to work together with the Fluffy Puncher uh, to make Minecraft videos together. Uh, I had a few channels before this one as well, but this one by far did the best and made me make videos for, for the longest time. And uh, But who made me actually go into YouTube? Well, my first reason to start making YouTube videos was actually the Oxcast Shadow Visrafel with their Shadow of Israfel storyline and the way they made the videos was so engaging and fun and I wanted to make my own Minecraft story based video series which actually kind of happened at the start of this channel but didn't really go anywhere but it was still a lot of fun to make those and I just went from there and watching videos from PewDiePie, Markiplier, Ajaxepticeye, Terrific Grace, Spectacle, uh, I did a thing, I don't know any channel that really captivates my views, uh, motivates me to make more and better content. Which is absolutely not what this is. <laughs> what is your end goal for YouTube if you have one? To be fair, having a thousand subscribers was basically my end goal. But since we're way past that, um, well, I don't know. I'm just going and see where everything goes. For me, it's, it's not really setting any goals. I just, I just want to see where we can actually take this and anything beyond what we actually have right now is a major milestone for me, so thank you. <laughs> 4. Will you be playing Minecraft Dungeons on the channel? If I got the money, I would, but I'm poor. Please send help. <laughs> Shroomy Gamer asks, favorite waifu? Actually a tough question, but um... 
That's probably gonna have to be Joseph Joser is my favorite waifu. Takia Joseph. My editor knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> All I've got under my skirt is more tequila, big boy. Is it all right to bring that through too? He also asks, any TV show or anime you like? Well, I am have been converted over to the JoJo fandom, so that's my favorite TV slash anime ever created because it's just so much fun to watch. I know the JoJo fandom is basically always like, watch JoJo, you gotta watch JoJo. And that's shit, and it sucks that they are everywhere, but Jojo is just a f an amazing goddamn anime, so go watch it if you have nothing to do this quarantine, which I guarantee you. Irregular Louie asks, what are you going to do when you hit a million? I'm gonna assume he means a million subscribers? Well, probably be dead by then, because <laughs> because it took me, I mean, one and a half year to get from, for, uh, from 2k to 3k? I think even longer. If by any chance, in my lifetime, I hit a million subscribers, probably hopefully still doing this. Making just shitty videos where I have fun and you guys have fun, hopefully. And, I don't know, live in a big mansion, be Logan Paul, no, fuck that. <laughs> Nina the Lunala asks, who's your favorite animator? Oh god, that's a tough one. Favorite animation channel on YouTube, I, I'm gonna assume you're asking, is um, Ed's World. Ed's World? Uh, for any OG YouTubers out there that actually know it, is uh, a YouTube channel created by Ed Ghoul. Um, rest in peace. Uh, he made animations all by himself with a bunch of friends. Tomska is one of those characters that voices in their videos. Tomska is a pretty big YouTuber as well. But Ed World, uh, back in 2011 when I just started watching YouTube and got into it myself, those were the videos I watched and they still hold a very dear place in my heart. Favorite horror game? Tarnished, the video game. Check it out, guys. It's not actually out, but holy shit. No, favorite horror game? Probably Amnesia, The Dark Descent. I mean, come, that's an easy one. I mean, PewDiePie, Stefano, bros, bros, are you gonna subscribe, bros? Three, do do art. If yes, how long? I think you're trying to ask if I do do art, and if so, for how long? Yes, I make art. I have an Instagram and where I post most of my art. Although I haven't posted in a few months, actually. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. I, I, I don't do my job or what? But yeah, I, I've been making art for as long as I can remember. I think my first drawing was when I was two years old. Maybe I can find it. Maybe I can put it up on the screen. Probably not. I uh, Maybe. Maybe I will make a visual representation of it. Or maybe my editor will. <laughs> but yeah done art for basically all my life and I really like doing it. It's just, it's fun to draw. Drawing dicks is just such such a great amount of fun. <laughs> what fandoms are you in? Well, if you're actually talking about toxic kind of fandoms, I'm actually not in those. I'm, I, I enjoy things, but I don't enjoy it that much where I devote actual parts of my life to it. Um, but if it's actually things in life I really enjoy and I always get a positive feeling about. It's either uh, Dark Souls, all the Dark Souls game is just fantastic. Jojo, even if there are bad parts to the fandom, I really enjoy the anime and the show and all the jo jokes people make about it. Um, and Minecraft. The Minecraft community is amazing. Riri Colleen probably butchered it, sorry, <laughs> asks, what are a few games you haven't played that you would like to? Elden Ring, where the f*** is it from, so please let us know something. <laughs> and Minecraft Dungeons, because I'm poor. <laughs> Your Lost Glasses asks, do you speak any other languages other than English? Uh, weet ik niet man, ik moet ook even, even nadenken of, uh, of ik ook pannenkoekjaans kan praten, maar waarschijnlijk niet, dus... I hope my editor translate that shit, because that would be fun. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Also, have you ever done those ancestry tests? Uh, no, not actual bought them, but I've done one on Gradient, which tells me I'm 87% German. Which is close enough, I guess. So, I mean, I don't know what you want. <laughs> Telling stories with a dinosaur puppet uh, As what is your favorite fast food place to go to? Uh, probably a restaurant where they would actually serve me with dinosaur puppets. That sounds that sounds quite 
quite great. I don't know if my editor does anything with it, with it, but check out uh, the channel of uh, Tending Stories with a Dinosaur Puppet. It, it's great. It's so wholesome. Just check it out. Isaac Ortiz asks, what do you plan on doing when you get older? What I plan on doing? I have no idea. My life is a f***ing mess, man. I, I, I have no actual plans for the future. I don't know anything. What am I doing with my life? Please send help. Those were all the questions, boys and girls, gamers and non-gamers. I hope you all enjoyed and I made your life just a little bit, tiny bit enjoyable for at least a few minutes. If you did, why not consider subscribing, liking, hitting that bell in the face. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for 3k subscribers. Actually insane. Give yourself a victory royale, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye-bye.